Hello, my name is Kevin Wilson. I'm on the iPrint team. This video will be to discuss TIT 7022057. The TIT talks about how to enable the iPrint IPP page with OES 2018 and iPrint Appliance 3.1. Starting with the iPrint Appliance 3.1 and OES 2018, the traditional iPrint IPP page is no longer available. So when you go to the IPP page, you're redirected to the iPrint portal page. So as you can see in this example, when we put in the IPP page, you are redirected to the iPrint portal page. To enable the IPP page, we have provided a command to enable that. So we'll cut and paste this command into a putty session. You'll be asked to restart Apache, so we'll say yes to restart Apache, and that is a requirement. It restarts Apache. At this time, when we go to the IPP page, it will take us to that page. So we'll put in IPP here. And as you can see, we're back to the traditional IPP page. If you want to disable that, you could take the same command and instead of doing dash dash enable, you do a dash dash disable, as shown in this TID. Thank you for watching this video.